Do 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 do. I am taking a big dump on probably Lanky's face, cause he's it's the most popular Kong, and I don't like popular things. Be cause it's fucking can be to like the thing that's popular. Why the fuck should I like it? Just because everyone else likes it, no, that's a really bad reason. Fuck, I'll start the video. Welcome back to Donkey Kong 64, and I am playing as Lanky. And we're in this giant fucking igloo that I just really awkwardly ended the last video on. Oh, it's the land of the beavers again. I don't remember how to get up here. I think I'm supposed to kill all the beavers. I'm actually pretty certain that's what I'm supposed to do. Um, like, I, I'm pretty sure there's only two, which would make it a really pathetic thing. Or no, like, I remember, this is like an enemy gauntlet, and then you get to go and climb up the thing. Oh, dude, that one's a lot bigger than the rest of them. That's kind of odd. That's what she said. <laughs> Michael, Michael, please. Michael, please. Please. Um, there we go. Things happened. And then Lanky was happy. And now there's Lanky pads. Oh, Mr. Lanky, sorry. Sorry. I'm gonna do that with every Kong. Like, I've done it with Donkey Kong and, La and Chunky Kong. And now I've done it with Lanky Kong. Like, the Lanky, sorry. I don't know why I feel the need to do that. I also burp talked earlier. I don't know if that that'll be apparent in the video, but but I burp talked and it was it was glorious. It was like a victory. It was a titillation of my senses, and my senses were mildly titillated. By mildly, I definitely very much mean mildly. Oh, get the balloon before you go down there. That's what she said. That's a very awkward. That's what she said. Oh. Well, that thing's not moving nearly as fast as any of the other ones. Dude, follow the balloon! Except, that is the advice that I said to not do. Actually, like, legit, never follow the balloon. Just, like, pick a spot and just keep shooting. And I know, like, that's really bad advice because, like, you'll probably run out of ammo at some point. But milk? Milk. 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 Milf. 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 Milfy milk. Milky milf. That- Milk- Milky milf sounds almost as awkward as milfy milk. Like, you wanna screw the milk? I don't know, that just sounds so awkward to me. And I don't know if there's like an ultimate goal to this besides bananas, but I'm pretty sure that's basically about it. Um, maybe if you go in like the other direction, I'm pretty sure that's the only reason that they put the lanky pad there. Maybe if you go like straight up? No? Maybe over some random direction? I don't know. I'm gonna get Tiny Kong. Yes, and I know, in the last video I said like, Oh, we're gonna be using Diddy Kong a lot in this episode. And then that just really didn't happen, because after like five minutes in, you didn't really see Diddy Kong very much. Um, and I don't know if it was specifically like five minutes in, but whatever. Either way, I didn't use Diddy Kong as much, nearly as much as I said I would, so... I feel like I should use him more in this episode. He gets a decent amount of use in this, in this level too, because like his, his rocket barrel thing is like actually relatively useful. I have no idea what's back here, by the way. Like literally no idea. I could have already been here, but I haven't. Why is there chunky stuff? This is so odd. I don't know how to get back here with chunky. Maybe like there's a, there's a warp that appears after I beat this game. Oh God, not this again. I might not be able to do this. Um, Aid of Fire. See, you can always get the first one because, like, it's, like, it gives you lots of time, but I may not be able to do this. There we go, I got that one. No, that didn't go fast enough. I might have to go into concentration mode here because, like, you gotta do this so fast. It's Like, I literally have, like, 
probably about a quarter of a second to react to where this thing is. And if you shoot it in the wrong place, then you have to hit an extra one. There we go. Oh my god. Like, these, they're a lot harder than it looks. Trust me. Like, like, you need, like, really good reaction time to actually do that properly. Please have a warp up here. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe that's how... Okay, but that's where the other three warp is. Okay. Well, that seems relatively pointless, because there's literally only, like, a balloon and a few coins in here. And you can get 100% without doing that. I probably should have taken the three warp. Although, it's weird, because the wall looks like it's cracked. And it looks like you can break through it with, like, a big chunky punch, or, like, a big meaty chunky punch. One that's, like, really big and, and chunky. That's a really bad wording for that. I don't think you're supposed to be able to get there with di uh, Dixie Kong, with Tiny Kong, there we go. Although it is very easy to mistake her name for, for Dixie Kong, because they're basically like the same premise. It's a a girl Kong with po pigtails or whatever, versus a girl Tong Kong with a ponytail. I don't know. It's basically about the same. Now, I don't know if I'm like, by candies. I really want to find Candy, because, like, I want to do her shit. That sounded really wrong. I I was trying to say I feel like it's that way, but I'm like, nope, that's a wall. Way to go, Kevin. Um, but yeah, you could basically get, like, from one end of the world to the other while just staying underwater. Oh, yeah, you have to go under the waterfall. That's right. I forgot about that. And that's how you get to Candies. Um, and now, basically, like, I can, tr I can attempt that super difficult thing with Donkey Kong, or I could wait until way later and just not worry about it right now. And I'm pretty sure that's what I'm gonna do. I never got this upgrade? Holy crap, I'm pretty sure you can get this upgrade in like Gloomy Galleon, which is like really dumb of me. I'm also pretty sure that Candy isn't in Fungi Forest, because I can't think of where she is. Third melon, that's such an awkward upgrade. Because there's never like a second melon upgrade. The second melon is just sort of like part of the, f the instrument. But like, just seeing like the the third melon thing, and she's, she's giving us like a tri-boob going on, I don't know, it's just like, it's the same, same premise as like having three boobs, it's just sort of awkward. Um, what is here? There's Chunky and Donkey down there. Um, this is basically like, sort of like the igloo, where there's like a lot of different, like, rooms in here, and there's one in particular with Diddy Kong that is the thing that's going to terrify me, but this, I know for a fact that like, basically all of these rooms have timers on like, mini games, and they will do the terrifying sound effect that I really hate. Um, this is like, a difficult version of, uh, that thing that I did in Fungi Forest, with, with the, these guys. Uh, I can't aim lower. That's annoying. Uh, well, I guess I could probably jump across here. But I'm pretty sure that the sound effect is not going to play in this particular room. Because I'm probably going to scream when it does, and I really don't want to scream right now because it's laid out. And I will probably get a general what the hell at me for screaming in the middle of the night in the basement for what probably would seem like no particular reason. I don't know. Man, I got a lot of golden bananas in the last video. I think I got like, like seven. That might be the new record. Oh, I don't like that sound effect either. I really don't. I, there's a lot of sound effects in this game where I'm just like really uncomfortable with. That was the balloon basically where I learned that like, hey, you're not supposed to like try and follow the balloon. You're supposed to just go and like get it or whatever. Uh, there's one up here, too. I think that's where the five warp is, but I could be wrong. And I know, like, I'm pretty sure this is a repeat. I don't think this is Lanky's. Oh, uh, there's Diddy, yeah. I don't know which one with Diddy is, like, the absurdly difficult one. Um, so I'm gonna skip both of them. And I'm sorry, I know I'd, I said that I was gonna give Diddy more screen time, but I'm not... I'm not mentally prepared for this right now. I'm just gonna do the chunky one and the DK one, and then probably, like, go bust around and get... Actually, I might just, like, go ahead and go to, um, Creepy Castle in this video. Maybe. Uh, oh god. Oh god. No, I know what this is. This is awful. Um, and this, this is one where there's, like, a high likelihood of, of me hearing the 
the terrible sound effect that I keep I keep preluding to this sound effect like it's the plague, but like I haven't actually heard it yet, so I don't know. It's just like it's so weird to me to be afraid of a sound effect in a video game. Like that is like the weirdest thing, but it's in like the most demonic voice. And anybody who's played this game before is probably instantly gonna know what I'm talking about. Oh god, get out of the light, get out of the light. Oh Jesus. Like you have no idea. Like my heart's going at like 160 beats per minute. I was gonna say 120, but I'm like, that's not that fast. Like, it's pretty fast. No, oh, I don't like that sound effect either. Welcome to no. Okay, okay. Sorry, I thought that was something different. Anybody who, again, anybody who has played this game before will know what I, I think it is. But I'm pretty sure there's there's one game in this, like one mini game in this game in particular, and it's called Beaver Bother. And anybody who has played that will know how just infuriating it is. And what I'm planning on doing is when I get to like, I'm pretty sure you have to play it three times. Once where you have like a lower limit for like what you have to get. Well, how many things you have to get, and once where you have like a, a higher limit, um, and I'm pretty sure that uh, like the lower one is in World Two, and the two, like I know there are two higher ones in World uh, in World Seven, Creepy Castle, and uh, I'm planning on doing those completely uncut. So basically, like I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna commentate and I'm gonna cry a lot and probably rip my hair out. Because it's just so, it's so frustrating. It's probably the most frustrating and broken thing that I've ever played in a video game. And it's basically the sole reason why this is like not my number one game of all time is because of that mini game. Because it's so, so bad. Like it's just, oh, it's so bad. And like, I don't know why they didn't like test it before. Like they, they probably never did test it. Oh God, what is this fresh hell? I have no idea what's going on in here. Um, all I know is I probably don't want to stand on those things. And there's... Oh, there's homing animo in the corner. Well, that's convenient. Very convenient. That exploded, like, right in front of me. That's what she said! <laughs> See, the homing ammo is kind of weird if there's, like, multiple targets. Um, because it's, it's just sort of going to go for, like, everything. What the fuck? That's weird. I guess I was hitting it on the bookshelf above me. Basically, like, what I like to do here is essentially pray and spray. Um, that's, that's the main strategy that I employ here. It's not what you have to do, and it's definitely not probably what's recommended. But, like, you could sort of do, like, the, uh, like the balloon strategy. And, uh, actually, why am I doing this? I can't play my instrument. That's why I'm doing this. Because I was like, I feel like an idiot because I could totally just play my instrument and kill all these things. But no, it won't let you in here. And I guess that's to prevent breaking the game. I don't exactly know. And I don't know what's the deal if uh, if you run out of ammo. Like, I don't think you can kill these things if you run out of ammo. Dude, come back here. Quit being a cocksmoke. Okay, I'm just gonna... Like, I saw there was other homing ammo in the corner here. And before I get to... Like overly frustrated. Can I stand on these boxes? Thank you. Um, before I get overly frustrated, I might as well try this, because I know you're supposed to do this with the homing ammo, but the homing ammo doesn't always help. There we go. Well, that helped. Holy crap. That was quick. Oh, banana. Oh, that is awesome. And with that, we got 80 golden bananas. Holy crap. Uh, Tiny and Chunky kicked ass in this world. Chunky is basically like 100% in here already. Um, which is weird, because, like, that was so fast. That felt way faster than it should have, because, like, I guess everything's sort of, like, clustered together in in a big sense. Like, like that's kind of awkward to describe, but, like, there's a lot of things in this world that are, like, really, really clustered together. Like, like these houses and, like, the igloo. But seeing as though I said that basically, like, I would meet the minimum requirements and then move on, I'm going to exit level... And we're going to go Creepy Castle because I love that world, but I'm going to do that in the next video. Next time at Donkey Kong 64.